Hello viewers. What's up? I am back with another video of Open Office Spreadsheets. Let's jump into the video. Today we will see selecting and manipulating cells. First of all I am taking a spreadsheet which already has same data fed into its cells. Let's try to do something with this data. Let's see selection of cells first. If you want to select a single cell then use your mouse to select the cell and also you can use arrow keys on keyboard to make other cell active. Number of cells can also be selected at a time. This selection in spreadsheet is known as range. Selection of range is of two types. Contiguous cells or cells which are adjacent to each other can be selected using mouse by selecting the starting cell to ending cell. This is a simple click and drag selection. To select a contiguous range using keyboard hold shift and use arrow keys. To select a contiguous range using both keyboard and mouse first click on a cell then hold shift and then click on another cell. Now we are done with selection of contiguous range of cells. And if you want to select various cells which are not adjacent to each other then hold control and click on the cells using the mouse. To select a row click on row heading or use shift and space bar. To select a column hold shift and control together and click on space bar. Similarly if you want to select the whole sheet click on select all or hold shift click space bar followed by control and click space bar again without leaving shift till the end. Now as we are done with how to select a cell or a range of cells, let's get down to entering the data into spreadsheets. The most straightforward way to enter data into cell is by clicking the cell and typing the data into it directly. When you want to edit a cell which already consists of some data double click on the cell or select the cell and click F2 or you can edit it in the formula bar also. Editing in formula bar is easy when the data in the cell exceeds the size. If you want to enter whole new data into the cell then just make the cell active and start typing. This will erase the old data and fill the active cell with the new data typed in. There is a good option in spreadsheets that will make your work little fast. Select a continuous range of cells and start entering data by clicking enter after completion of entering data into cell. After the last cell in column it automatically shifts into adjacent column. Now that we are familiar with selecting and manipulating cells we will look into inserting and deleting rows columns and cells. There are many methods to insert or delete rows columns and cells in a spreadsheet. The very straight way of inserting and deleting is select the row heading or column heading and right click on it with your mouse. Now you can see many options with two main options insert rows delete rows while you click on row headings. And insert and delete columns when you select a column heading and right click on it. The other way of doing this is using insert in the main menu bar. Select a cell at which you want to insert row column or another cell and use insert menu to create new ones. There is pop-up showing four options to insert new cells to spreadsheet. Let's see how each of the option works. Shift cells down shifts every cell on cell down and creates a new cell at the point of selection. Similarly shift cells right shifts all the cells one cell to the right from the cell selected and creates a blank cell. When entire row is selected every cell in the row is moved one cell down and a new row is created where the cell was active. Similarly when entire column is selected everything in the column moves on cell to the right and new column is created. Or the other way is to select the cell and go to insert and click insert rows to create rows and insert columns to create columns. So. This is how a new row column or cell is inserted into the spreadsheet. Now we will see how to delete cell column or rows from a spreadsheet. Again the straight way to do this is select a row right click on it and select delete row and to delete column select column and right click on it and delete column. Select a cell which you want to delete and right click on the cell. A menu appears with an option delete. Select delete and a pop-up shows up showing four options similar to the insert. Shift cells up or to the left according to the selection. Shift row up if you delete a row, column to the left if you delete a column. Please feel free to like, comment and share our video.
Also don't forget to subscribe to get our updates.